Hello Scorpions, welcome to Beauty True Tarot and this reading is about you versus them. So this reading is for those people who are in a third party situation and uh, in this reading I will pull out six cards for you and uh, we'll try to see what your person thinks about you and uh, then we will pull out uh, six cards for you know, the third party and uh, we'll try to figure out what this person feels with this, re uh, with this third party. So let's go ahead. This is just for scorpions. Eight of Pentacles. Seven of Pentacles. Nine of Pentacles. That's just for the third party. Two of Cups. Ten of Swords. And Queen of Swords. Okay. Looks like that this person made a quick judgment. Okay, but this two of cups looks like that this is more of a friendship rather than love. Maybe this person had a wonderful friendship with this third person. There was this understanding, there was this compatibility. There was this great compatibility, there was this um, you know, um, affection, but uh, I don't think that it was love. This person now knows that it was mistaken as love. A deep friendship was mistaken as love. And uh, I think that this person is blaming it all on you. They feel like that you made yourself distant from them. They feel like that love was no more your priority. They feel like, Scorpio, that you were too focused on something else. Maybe your career, maybe something else. Like... Uh, you know your job or something and then here you have this seven of pentacles i think that this person tried a lot to get your attention this person tried to trigger you a lot like um, they might have said something to make you jealous they might have done something to gain your attention and they felt like that uh, you were not there i'm not saying that you were not there scorpio I'm, and i'm not blaming you no not at all I mean, um, this is necessary. This Eight of Pentacles is necessary and everybody knows that. But this person is quite demanding. By their nature, this person needs constant attention. And that is a problem as well. But uh, I think that this person made an immature decision. They, you know, tried to get away. Get away from you. They felt like that uh, they can find someone else and this person was there. This person was spending time with your person. Okay, behind your back maybe this uh, person was a friend and uh, they developed a deep bond and this person mistook it as love because they were having great time with this third person and now they feel stuck. Maybe they tried to find um, a replacement they felt like if you cannot be there they can spend time with others and uh, they felt like that uh, these feelings grew deep and uh, grew, grew stronger so maybe they felt that it was love but now this person knows that it wasn't love 
they were merely trying to get uh, attention from someone else. This person seeks validation constantly. Okay, like they are loved, they are secure in this relationship, and um, for that, they did all this. This person is immature. Okay, they are still angry at you. You feel like that uh, you never understood them. I think that this person is mysterious. They don't they don't speak up their mind. They're not speaking it, you know, and uh, you don't know what they're up to. They are not telling it to this third person and uh, this third person also doesn't know what they're up to. But secretly they're writing down something. Maybe they have a diary or something and they're, they're, they're writing these things. They are trying to vent out frustration. And here we have Ten of Swords. This person feels like that um, they made a wrong decision. In an attempt to make you insecure or to make you jealous, they just made this um, stupid decision and now they are stuck. They are regretting. Because with this Nine of Pentacles, this person is still manifesting you. Knowingly or unknowingly, this person is constantly thinking about you and those energies can affect you as well. You might feel a longing towards them and that is because they are feeling a longing for you. Okay? However, this is a general reading. This isn't going to resonate for everyone and the energy could be reversed as well. Also, you can check your moon and rising sign. Let's go ahead and check some more messages for you. Messages for scorpions. Three of Cups. Five of Pentacles. And the world. That's this for the third person. Jet in reverse. Eight of Pentacles in reverse. And Queen of Pentacles in reverse. So here we have Eight of Pentacles in reverse. This person now understands the value of um, paying attention to other things as well. They now understand that why you were so focused on Eight of Pentacles because they now have this Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Maybe they know that it's not easy for them to survive um, only on love. <laughs> I mean here we have the third person and they already feel like that they have no money. This person is struggling. You know, maybe this person is too much demanding and they feel like that this person is totally dependent on them or maybe they feel like that um, this relationship is for benefits. Like uh, this third person is taking advantage of them. And uh, also this has made them realize that how your priorities were supposed to be priorities at this point. And now they understand you better. Yeah, we have that in reverse. Something has stopped. The progress in this relationship has stopped. Now this love is no more growing. And I feel like that uh, there is something just not right about this relationship. They already feel like that they need to give it a second thought. And here we have this Queen of Pentacles in reverse. They feel like that the third person is only tolerant until they are doing the things they want them to do. And as soon as they are not meeting up their expectations, this person is ready to unleash the bull. 
okay they now feel like that this person is mean and this person is self-centered also here we have three of cups maybe they're watching you enjoying your life they feel like that um, you being with other people mean that uh, means that you are you know interested in someone it's like you have a close friend and you feel like that uh, you have this connection with this third person and um, you know this is because they were like that okay they are looking at their own reflection and they feel like that uh, you are going to do the same and the world is here they feel like that you have got the world you have got the time to work on yourself you have got the time to treat yourself and uh, now you're feeling way better than before at least that is what they think so this was a reading about you versus them i hope you enjoyed it thanks for watching till next video bye